ओके वी आर मूविंग इन टू द थर्टीन क्लास फॉर द सेंटेंस करेक्शन इट्स लुक एट द फर्स्ट वन इट सेज दैट गैसोलाइन मार्केटिंग एंड डूइंग मेजर चेंज एस स्टेशन ऑफर नॉट ओनली एट कन्वीनियंस बट ऑल्सो कम्बाइन विथ कम्बाइन विथ मेजर फास्ट फूड चेंज टू बिल्ड ओके सो नॉट ओनली बट ऑल्सो इज इज राइटली यूज एज फॉर नाउ but also also but also but we have not only but also in each of the option so we have to find out the right comparison of the right thing so let's check out so not only at convenience stores but also combine with uh, major fast food change chains uh, to build complex complexes where customers can shop and eat as well as buy gasoline okay so not only at convenience stores but they combine with major fast food chain who is they so not only they add but they combine so that should be parallel are not only often are not only no often not only at convenience stores but also combine why is combining combine with something like that so also combine are not only adding convenience store but also in combining with major fast food chains they built weird pronouns and is is combining with in combining with is weird so they not only add a uh, uh, convenience store but also combine so a remains the way it is in the best form let's move at the next and the next one says that scientists say that each of the photographs taken of aries villas plain by mars finder indicates the overwhelming extent of flooding on the planet billions of years ago and the degree that rocks were scattered now the placement of word is uh, these sentences are very wrong let's look at it indicates uh let's look at option a again indicates the overwhelming extent of flooding on the planet billion of years ago and the degree that rocks were scattered so <coughs> and the degree to which rocks were scattered as as indicated in all of the other option that that makes it idiomatically right so indicates uh, that is wrong so indicates the overwhelming extent of the floods on which oh on which planets weird let's try to compare between c and d because the degree both have degree to which both start with indicate okay indicate and indicates we can get a hint of this whether it's a singular or a plural so photographs taken from our uh, so there are photographs so we have we are talking about photographs taken from mars finder indicate okay so in that way is option we are left with option d and option e so indicates the overwhelming extent of the flooding on the planet on the planet billion of years ago and degree to which rocks were scattered okay and the dig and the degree that no degree to which is the right way to use so that makes us select d as the best option so the subject verb agreement bring us to indicates and extend to flooding makes e out Let's look at the third one. It says that as a result of supernova explosion, every human being on Earth was bombarded on 29th by around about 100 billion neurons. Fortunately, neutrinos <coughs> are harmless elementary particles that are produced in nuclear reactions and that interact very weakly with matter. Okay. So 
I don't see any problem in it for now. Let's look at other options. Neutrinos, which are harmless, are elementary particle particles produced in nuclear reaction, and which interact very weakly with human. Oh, so neutrinos which are harmless and which which are harmless are ele and are elementary particle produced in nuclear reaction and which interact weakly with matter there is a lot of redundancy in this one so uh, why are we uh, using uh, which are harmless and are elementary r r two times we can use are harmless and elementary particles and also the placement of which makes this option go out so b option goes out neutrinos are harmless elementary particles produced in nuclear reaction and which interact okay this is uh, the parallelism is lost so 100 billion fortunately so fortunately and we have to explain why so neutrinos are harmless elementary particles produced in and which and that interact very weakly with matter so out of that of course that is a better option let's look at option d comma these harmless elementary particles are produced in nuclear reaction we did not talk about uh, who are these so breaks the continuity and why are talking about neutrinos at the end so that that makes uh, d and e goes out good good ones are a a b and c which are harmless so a and c are left with us so neutrinos are harmless elementary particles produced in nuclear reaction i think we need a dead there to join it and which uh, interact very weak, uh, weakly so we need a dead to join them so a becomes a best option Let's move to the fourth one. It says that the federal rule aimed at uh, protecting human subjects of medical experiment were established to ensure that patients must be warned of potential risk, and an independent panel would evaluate the experiment before it was conducted. Okay, so patients must be warned of potential risk, and an independent panel would evaluate. So. we need a that here i think must be uh, that an independent and that yep we need a that here so must be one of potential and that an independent uh, would be one so b and c we need would because the federal rules talk about the future and not the past so would is an essential part so we cannot Uh, live without that so will be warned about potential risk and an independent panel so we are la lacking a that let's look at option a would be warned of potential risk and that an independent so we are talking about two things ensure that patients must be and that independent panel so when we talk about parallelism the that is required so which makes e the best option so this is again a parallelism question Let's move to the next. It says that research has shown that when speaking, the individuals who have been blind from the birth and thus never seen anyone gesture, nonetheless make hand motion just as frequently as in the same way sighted people do, and that they will gesture even when conversing with another blind person. So. this is about the uh, the instincts that body have that the we are going to make gesture even if we don't see people doing them so something like that so let's uh, look at uh, how things are starting and ending in the same way sighted people do and that 
have been blind from the bed gesture okay have thus never seen anyone gesture but nonetheless make hand motion as frequently and in the same way that sighted people do and they and they will gesture and that they i think we need a dat here let's look at the option shown that when speaking individuals who have been with her have not just as in the same way and that so we need a dat here that that's, that's the first hint and we have an idiom here uh, which says that uh, x and dash okay so have thus never seen any one gesture that they we need a but so those have those have never seen those they never seen any one gesture so the way in which uh, thus has been placed so that breaks the idiomatic way and we have several idiomatic ways that are broken here which makes a the best option Let's move at question six. It says that in the major cities of these countries at the end of the 19th century, important public places such as Sri Lanka, Assam, Shop Block had installed electric light, but electricity was less than one percent of homes where lighting was still provided mainly by candles. So, uh, in public places, electricity came, but in in private houses, it was not. Okay, so but we have to compare some things. So, in the middle of the end of 19th century, important places uh, was installed, but was not installed but there was less than 1% okay let's look at the option so we are talking about electricity installation so but electricity was less than 1% of the homes where lighting was still uh, provided by okay electricity was in less than 1% of the homes and lighting still no we are ch changing the meaning uh but there was less than 1% of homes we cannot we cannot we are not talking about home we should start with electricity because we had electricity in the first part but so uh, the last part is more well lightning was still okay electricity well lighting was still being being makes it go out so but there were less than 1% of homes that had electricity having lightning having lighting that was still weird less than 1% of homes had electricity where lighting had still been so we are changing a lot of meaning let's try to understand this so all of the options are playing with the and part so a is simple a works fine and a keeps uh, 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 the electricity closer and the second part is another big hint so we have in option uh, e we have having lightning that was still provided so who is having lightning is electricity having lightning so d goes out we are modifying the wrong way there's an uh, electricity where lightning had still being so had still being is incorrect and we are modifying the time frame so we are good with a as it is and here is the explanation for you So let's look at uh, question seven. It says that according to two teams of paleontologists, recent fossil fuel discoveries in Pakistan show that whales show that. Okay. So of course, show should be uh, followed by that. Option C, D, and E can never be the option. So show that whales, porpoises, and dolphins are more closely related to some of the oldest. 
नोन इवन टोंगलेट इज अ ग्रुप ऑफ ओफीड मैमल्स दैट टूडे इंक्लूड्स ग्रुप ऑफ ओफीड मैमल दैट टूडे इंक्लूड्स रोक मैमल ओके देन टू एनी अदर मैमल ओके सो दे हैव बीन रिलेटेड टू दिस देन दिस सो वी नीड अ देन देर we need a that so that and then combination goes out with a and we have to stick to a this is this was one of the easiest one of the day so that makes life easy for us let's move to the next and we are at the eighth one eighth one says that when the temperature of a gas is increased it is a accompanied by increase in pressure if the gas is enclosed in a container so either or an increase in volume if the gas is able to expand this is the pv rule okay so when the temperature of the gas is increased it is either accompanied by an increase uh, in pressure if the gas is enclosed in a container okay so when a gas it is either what so it is placed in a weird way it is uh, either accompanied by increase in or if the gas so so when the temperature of gas is increased comma it it refers to gas but uh, we can avoid that and uh, it should be uh, clear enough so when the temperature of gas is increased again the same issue when the temperature of gas is increased the increase is either accompanied by an increase in pressure if the gas is enclosed in the container or by increase in volume if the gas is able to expand so a company when the gas so increase is either accompanied weird way of placement and it should be accompanied either by or by so either accompanied by is weird way to put, put that and d makes the same issue let's look at option e any increase in temperature of the gas is accompanied either by an increase in pressure if the gas is enclosed in the container or by increase so either by increase in the pressure of if the gas is enclosed or by increase okay so that makes the second part also parallel and clean so e becomes the best option so it was ambiguous we need to compare the things and place them such that they match the second half let's look at the ninth one it says some patient who do not respond to therapies for depression may simply receive inadequate treatment comma as for example or having for example been prescribed a drug at a dosage too low to be effective or having been taken off drug too soon so they either they have a low a low prescription or their drug was taken off too soon some patient not with therapies for depression may simply have received inadequate treatment for example yes so it should be uh having for example why do you want to keep we want to keep like for example we prescribed this or this as for example is again redundant so let's th this is a tricky one let's try to look at it but uh, we need other reason or so if we are using having then we should be using having parallel so had had there been no having in the second part uh, i would have been uh, very inclined to remove this having let's look at the reason so uh, having for example a drug prescription that was ineffective because the does okay having prescribed a drug at a dosage low or as if that was ineffective because the drug losses were low or being b goes out we don't use being so as for example or being so whatever we want to do we should keep it parallel so having for example or having taken off so whatever we want to choose it should be parallel enough so let's look at it with those parallel glasses so may simply have received inadequate treatment uh when they have okay weird let's look at e for example when they have a drug prescription with a dosage too low to be effective 
or when they have drug taken out so so whatever we want to uh, include should be parallel and let me show you uh, the explanation to make it more clear because this is a longer sentence so having been and having been should be parallel in the e it's not parallel in d it's not parallel so whatever the two things you are taking it should be parallel that's one way to read it so look at option d it says that the budget for education reflects the estimated demand that the money is controlled by local school district but it can be spent on teachers uh not only book computer or other material activities okay so the money is controlled by local school but it can be spent on teacher what is it referring to and and th that becomes my major question so the let's look at option b the money controlled by local school districts but it allows them to spend money so it it is pointing out uh, now uh, refers to the budget because both clauses are parallel the money is to be controlled in local schools but it only to be spent uh, there are uh, comma and make makes it weird so local school districts are in control of the money but it allows them to spend the money only oh weird and these are illogical options so the best option here which rightly refers it is option b so but is the parallel maker money is controlled by the local district but it allows them to spend money only a little tricky one that would do it for the 13th session thank you for watching this recording see you in the next